Welcome to the Bayern view and welcome to this video. Now, first things in order, subscribe. Secondly, uh, like the video if you like it. And three, put alarm bells if you like this channel. So, yeah, before I start, though, uh, I want to address something. So I was supposed to upload this video. Not me. I mean, obviously, Liam. Liam was supposed to upload this video earlier, but I forgot to record last night. So you're probably going to get this video later on today or sometime tomorrow. I have no idea. I'm recording on Wednesday afternoon, actually. So, yeah, just for you guys to know why the video is coming out late, it's my fault, not Liam's fault. Uh, but yeah, to begin this video, we're going to be talking about my guy, my G, Alfonso Davies, right? How oh, he's linked to Real Madrid as per usual. Uh, and this news is, I mean, off Instagram uh, of a chat of uh, what's, what's, what's the chat? transfers. So, yeah, this account is called transfers. So, yeah, I'm going to read the rumor. Uh, as it says, rumor over here. Uh, Real Madrid are interested in signing 22 year old. Alfonso Davies from Bayern. The Canadian left back has two years left on his current deal at, Ali, at the Allianz. And Madrid will look to sign him at a cut price next summer with Davies currently stalling contract negotiations with the German side. Would he be a good signing for Real? I mean, let's be honest. He probably would be a good signing for Real. But do we want to let him go? No. Do Bayern themselves want to let them go? No. No, no, they don't. What's the problem, though? Well, the problem is, is that Alfonso Davies and his agent are waiting. Like, it's like Musial, pretty much. They're, they're waiting to see what's going on at the club. And they're waiting to see what's going to be happening during their next discussions in regards to their negotiations. Now, I'm assuming they want to make sure that the club is in stable conditions. In terms of the football side, they want to make sure that they're going to be competing in all fronts. I mean, we're already going to be competing in the league, obviously. If we win the league every year. Uh, DFB Pokal, I mean, we lose quarterfinal, semifinal games. I don't I don't know why. Right? We should be doing better for our standards. But we generally compete. Generally, right? We have the most Pokals anyway. But it's just recently we haven't been. And Champions League, we always lose quarterfinal games. Last time we made past the quarters, we won the whole thing. So... That answers the question, right? So, well, Bayern need to get themselves sorted. Otherwise, this guy's out the door. And he's probably going to force his way out. I hate to say I, I don't want to say this, but I have a feeling he might force, he might force his way out if, he, if we don't like get things sorted at the club. And it starts with Tuchel, man. This guy. Like, he, he, Davies plays. But Bayern don't perform. That's the problem. So, yeah, it is what it is. Personally, look, Davies, for me, I'm going to analyze what type of player he is, yeah? He's a type of player that, going forward, unbelievable, except he can't finish. <laughs> Defensively, I think he's pretty underrated. I mean, yes, he's not amazing. I'm not, obviously, he's not like the best defensive left by and Nobody's going to ever say that. But he does save us sometimes in key situations, like in one-on-one -on -one situations, because of his pace, his recovery runs, and... His physicality is not as bad as people make it out to be. So, that's my thing on Davies. Listen, Bayern, at the end of the day, it's not just also the football side. It's also how much he's going to get paid. It's also, you know, the people around him. There are so many factors. What if the Madrid project impresses him? Because let's keep in mind, Real Madrid, yeah, they have a squad. They're just missing a left back. And if I'm not mistaken, because I have a friend, he tells me all the time, they're missing a right back as well, because Carvajal ain't it anymore. So, um, for me, yeah, this is my opinion. I told my friend this. They're missing a striker. So, which, um, let's be honest, if Mbappe joins, that's it. So, yeah, man, I won't be surprised if Davies wants to get the hell out of Bayern and goes to Real Madrid within the next year or two when his contract is, like, running out. And when it comes to, comes to that one year left on the deal, he's going to become cheaper. So. Yeah, it's looking sticky, man. So, I have a question for you guys. What do you think about this entire situation? Do you think that Alfonso Davies is going to leave? Do you think he should leave? Uh, do you think we can replace him? I'll be real. I don't think we can replace him, but I want to know your opinion. Even though, yes, we have Kratzik, who's a young coming left back slash midfielder. Yes. 
We've seen what he could do in preseason. We've seen all that. But is it enough? I don't know, man. I would love to have Davies and Kratzik for squad depth. But, yeah, it is what it is. So, yeah, as I was saying to conclude in this video, um, like, subscribe, keep the alarm bells if you want more videos coming up. And, yeah, until then, see you next time.